In this video, let's take a look at polling with React Query. Polling basically refers to the process of fetching data at regular intervals. For example, if you have a component that shows the real-time price of different stocks, you might want to fetch data every second to update the UI. This ensures the UI will always be in sync with the remote data irrespective of configurations like refetch on mount or refetch on window focus which is dependent on user interaction. Now to poll data with React Query, we can make use of another configuration called refetch interval. By default, it is set to false. However, you can set it to a number in milliseconds which will result in a continuous refetch of the query at that interval. For example, if I set it to 2000, the query will automatically refetch every two seconds. Let's head to the browser and test this out. You can see that the query toggles between fetching and stale every two seconds. Of course, our data does not change over a period of time, but if your query is fetching data, which does change every second, polling is pretty helpful. And it is as simple as specifying the refetch interval configuration and setting it to the interval at which you want the data to be refetched. Two seconds in our case. Now one point I would like to highlight here is that the polling or automatic refetching is paused if the window loses focus. If you do want background refetching at regular intervals, you can specify another configuration called refetch interval in background and set it to true. So this will continue to pull data even when the browser is not in focus. So using refetch interval and refetch interval in background, you can pull data and provide a really good user experience in applications where the data changes every now and then. Imagine the code you have to write if you had to do this all by yourself. React Query does it with just two properties. I hope you're now able to see just how much React Query simplifies data fetching. If you're enjoying the videos, please do leave a like as it helps out a lot and I'll see you in the next video.